All right, I finished row nine. You finished row nine. Did you um, move your row counter to show that you've finished row nine? Make sure you've done that. You've finished row nine. So let's read our pattern. Row seven, row eight, row nine, row 10. Okay, row 10 is the same as row eight. All right, this is that little weird row again. So row eight, row, row eight. You're going to knit one, purl four, and then you do this repeating bit between the asterisks. So let's start with that much. You're going to knit one, then you're going to purl four, purl one, purl two, purl three, purl four. Brilliant. Knit one, purl four. Now you got the asterisk and you're going to repeat that stuff in the asterisk until eight stitches remain on the needle. So you're going to repeat knit three, purl seven. So I want you to go ahead and do that knit three, purl seven, knit three, purl seven, knit three, purl seven until eight stitches remain. All right, I'm just at that point now until I have eight stitches left on this row 10. See, there's my eight stitches that are left. So when there's eight stitches left, then you do knit three, purl four, knit one. Knit three, purl four, knit one. So you knit three, one, two, three, and then you purl four, one, two, three, four, and then you knit one. Knit one, and now you have finished row 10 and you have to change your row counter. So 10, that's nine, so it'll be zero and a one. You can get mixed up sometimes thinking when you come back to it and you look at that and you'll think, oh, actually I finished row one. But when you try to, if you forget where you are, just try turning some of the numbers and it'll become pretty clear where you're at. So we just finished row 10. Congratulations!